this is the first vlog of 2021 and I'm feeling good about it. I'm so excited to be back vlogging. I've been looking forward to vlogging, honestly, for days. Um, What the hell is actually going on with my hair? You guys probably know from my Instagram stories, but I'm on furlough again for the third time. <laughs> I'm trying to stay productive every day and basically write myself um, a little list of things to do. So today I have actually just been wrapping um, Depop parcels to go. This is a skinny dip case and this girl has bought some Topshop jeans. And um, yeah, I got up at nine o'clock. I tidied my room and looked at my list of things to do today. And this is honestly making me feel so much more productive and like I've actually got stuff to do while I'm not working. So yesterday I filmed two videos and got some Instagram pictures. That was like my goals for yesterday. Today um, it's vlogging, so here I am. <laughs> Depot parcels, I also need to go and take them to the post office. Um, Organise my room, I've done that. But I also need to organise this drawer here, which is an absolute state. Um, I need organising really badly. I need to select um, some products from Zaffo because they're going to gift me some clothes. I want to film a TikTok, but that might go to tomorrow because I don't really want to put on makeup today. Um, and I also need to film two videos. So, yeah, my next... Ta oh, I can tick off those parcels, actually, because I wrap them up. But I just need to take them to the post office, which I will do after lunch I think Um, two is for our flat and one is for my boyfriend's birthday because he likes a candle and yeah over Christmas H&M Home had like the worst stock but they've got loads of nice things back into stock online so I saw these candles ages ago in the shop and I had a voucher to use so I picked these up and they're really cute it is fig scented and it comes in this gorgeous black um, pot with this corkscrew lid very cute and it smells oh my god it smells so good this one is linen scented so it's a lot more fresh maybe this could go in the bathroom to be fair um yeah so this is very cute and these candles were literally like four pounds something each so so these are what they look like they look so pretty we we'll have to find a place for them to put in the flat Look at how much recycling me and Alice have. This is a <laughs> oh my god, it's an actual mountain. That is so bad, and we can't take this out until Thursday either. And today it's Tuesday because they don't um, empty the recycling bins outside. Oh dear, that does not look cute. If you watched my um, videos before Christmas, I showed you guys this HM little kind of like Borg material um, basket, and I couldn't find anywhere to put it, but I actually think this looks kind of cute in the corner there and um, we just put like shoes and sliders and stuff in it so yeah I'm actually glad we kept it because it's probably going to be useful for storage as this flat literally has no storage anywhere. <laughs> moved in that she's gonna get a desk and she just hasn't ordered one <laughs> and it's gone out of stock twice but she's finally ordered a desk so guys this little bouquet is from a really cute little independent company um, I don't know if it means you can find her on Instagram she's called Rosie Ida 
and her Instagram, I'm going to leave it on screen, but yeah, she makes the cutest little flower bouquets, and my mum actually sent me this, it's like a little flat warming present, but didn't turn up, so she sent out another one in the post, bless her, with a little note saying, sorry you had to wait so long for these, Amy. So guys, if you've watched my Christmas video, I don't know if that'll be out yet actually, my Christmas present video, um, my boyfriend's sister-in-law got me this coffee machine, which me and Alice are so excited about, and she also got us some um, Starbucks toffee nut latte pods, which is very exciting. So we're going to try the machine, because I've not actually tried it yet, and I don't know how to work it. So I'm going to figure it out, and then I'm going to let you know if it's good. I'm so excited to actually have a coffee machine in my life. I had a really yummy, I honestly intended to look alright in this vlog, I was thinking the first vlog of 2021, I'm going to put on some makeup but yeah anyway, we'll move past that, um, so I had a really nice chicken salad for lunch, it was really yummy, I had it with green beans and it was delish and then um, also now I'm just going to nip to the post office down the road and um, send off these two Depop parcels to two of you lovely girlies. And then for the rest of the day, I need to organise my drawer. I want to make some Hello Fresh food tonight. So, yeah, it's a productive but a nice chilled um, day. So, yeah, I'm going to head to the post office now and I will speak to you a bit later. Everyone's definitely making the effort because obviously London is really bad right now for COVID. Everyone's definitely, I think, making the effort to really walk around each other, have your masks on and cues and stuff, which is good. But yeah, I am definitely feeling a lot more wary now of going out and about because it's like one in 30 or something crazy. And obviously, I walk past more than 30 people. It's just, yeah, but then again, like, I had to go to the post office. So it's just one of those things. But uh, yeah, I've also got a new clip through from a lovely girl. Um, I'll actually leave her um, name on screen who's made me a YouTube intro, which I love. Just had a work call with marketing just for like a catch up because we still try to like speak every week, even if we're not in the office or on furlough. Um, so that was lovely. Spoke to all the marketing team. So I feel, I feel like we're vlogging at the moment because I feel like I've got nothing to vlog about. But I know you guys like the homely, normal, mundane vlogs. So I need to tell myself and remind myself that you do like these vlogs. Um, but yeah, please comment down below what you want to see in my vlogs just so I know that I am making what you guys like to watch um guys I'm literally so excited for this meal so yeah it's my first hello fresh meal that I've ordered um and I've gone for the spicy prawn pasta with char grilled courgettes tonight I want something quite quick and easy because I am so hungry Alice has got her um cottage pie oh god it's all steamy in the oven and um, that's also a hello fresh one our fridge is just stocked full of hello fresh so we're very happy gals um and i'm gonna leave mm, maybe i'll leave it down below i'll leave a link down below but also message me on instagram if you want my discount code because it basically gets you almost a free box which is unreal so i'm gonna make this delicious pasta now I'm going to run you guys, this is not an ad by the way, I've literally ordered this myself, um, I know that they work with quite a few influencers, but yeah I'm going to run you through it as well because I feel like you guys might want to remake this. So, 
I, I cooked the courgette for like five minutes, put it to the side, and now I'm just boiling the water for the um, pasta and cooking the, uh, what's it called, onion, red onion, which I added myself, and also added kale myself just for some extra greens, um, and also cooking the spring onion and garlic in the pan. And then I'm gonna add the passata and the sun dried tomato paste into the pan next. but I've mixed everything together waiting for the pasta, got my little courgettes for the topping I've also put some courgettes into the mix got my prawns, got my cheese and yeah, we're about ready I'm very excited Look. Good morning guys, so I've just made me and Al a toffee nut latte from the new coffee machine and it's lush um, So I've just brought this back to bed, I'm still in my dressing gown and it's literally nearly 11 o'clock But I woke up this morning feeling like I'd had like the worst night's sleep um, oh, oh god, is that gonna... Yeah, that'll be fine I think um, worst night's sleep so I'm just gonna have a lazy day today um, I've got this to unbox with you guys as well later on and I'm just gonna have a look at this which is my dreams dictionary I absolutely love knowing the meaning of dreams um, it sounds a bit silly to some people but I know a lot of you guys probably relate um, and I've had a few weird dreams last night so I'm gonna search up the meaning of that and then the next thing I'm gonna do is get the actual links ready to send off to Zaffle because I'm working with them on some sort of content so I need to get the links, send them to my manager and then she can send them to Zaffo and they'll send me over what I want. They've given me quite a good budget as well of things to choose from so yeah I'm excited. I'm also getting my boyfriend something as well from the Zaffo website so he's buzzing about that. Um, so yeah that is my little plan for the morning. Oh my god, wow. That is so beautiful. <gasps> how I look in this vlog because I'm not planning to put on a face anytime soon. I'm trying to let my skin breathe um, while I have to go out so yeah. But basically I've just been binge watching um, 
the Real Housewives of Jersey. Oh my god, I actually look, I actually look so bad. Um, but I've been binge watching the Real Housewives of Jersey, and yeah, I've decided I need to sort out this drawer of doom because I've been putting off for days now, and it actually looks so bad. Like it's just full of skincare. Also, for lunch, I had my um. Hello Fresh pasta that I made last night and I've still got another portion left. Like one meal from Hello Fresh has lasted me three portions, which is actually so good. Um, and what else have I been doing in the meantime? Um, I've been organising some like brand collaborations and stuff, which is really exciting. I've got a video coming up with lounge underwear, which I'm so excited about, but that's not going to come out till nearer Valentine's. I've got a Zaffle, oh, I've already told you about that. I've got working with Zaffle and something else as well which I can't remember but yeah I've met lots of fun things in the pipeline which I'm so glad about because it gives me like something to do um in lockdown but anyway yeah this is the drawer um it's just absolutely like full to the brim of skincare and makeup and hair care that is literally all it is and body care so yeah the task for the next half an hour is to sort this out because it's really stressing me out and I'm not using all my products properly because I can't see them so yeah, that is the plan. <laughs> So I don't know if it actually looks a lot better, but to me, this is a lot better. So I've put it all in sections now. Um, I've got all my like scrubs and face masks and like beauty bags here and a gift card for Space and Care. Um, this one is full of skincare. And then down here, I've got like toners and cleansers. Um, here I've got hair stuff, fake tan. This is another box of skincare. I've got all my perfumes here. This box is full of makeup and then there's loads more. Um, hair care products here and then yeah that's pretty much it I've got my deodorants and um, this little box here is full of makeup brushes and eyeliners so yeah now I know at least I know where everything is I need to find a place for these candles this is teeth whitening stuff and then I've got some stuff to chuck there and to find a place for my hair rollers but yeah done I did it only took me like 20 minutes as well so that was a pretty easy task hey guys so it's a little bit later now i've just been on facetime for ages with the boy and choosing his birthday present i'm gonna get this for him because he wants this it's a really nice nike um track suit from jd and i'm just waiting on borrowing a student discount because they have 20 percent off at the moment which is going to make it so much cheaper but yeah <laughs> these um what is it pork yeah no beef pack tacos i've got pickled cucumber here i've got my wraps this is like a sriracha mayo that i need to mix um i need to add this to the um veg so i've got peppers onions beef soy sauce honey a bit of more sriracha i need to add this ketchup mains ketchup mains i've got no idea what that is but i need to add this to it and then it's basically done when this is all cooked, so it was super quick and easy. I'm going to heat up the wraps, but I'm very excited for this. actually not my favorite hello fresh meal because the flavors were quite like overpowering but it was really good like um 
I'm gonna have another one in a bit because they were really good but just not my favorite one yet um Alice is busy next door making her desk for her room and I'm just gonna watch some YouTube I think I love watching Emily Blackhorse videos she is from Maine Chelsea which is kind of weird but she's like the most realist person on YouTube I love watching her and yeah just gonna chill for the rest of the evening Hey guys, so I just got into bed and realised I had not even ended the vlog or spoke to you guys in a while. Um, but me and Alice were just watching The Cabins and then we watched um, the Pembrokeshire Murder series which is really, really good. And now I'm just watching my fave, she's called Maximilian Hansen on YouTube and she's German and lives in Berlin and yeah, she just really reminds me of like my family and how much I love Berlin and being over in Germany. I just cannot wait to get back over there. Um, yeah just i love the berlin life like they're just so cool over there and it's really making me want to go back but yeah she's just really real and um yeah i'm half german by the way guys if you didn't know that um big up so yeah i'm getting the vlog here thank you so much for watching um i and you won't be able to see me because it's dark but yeah thank you so much for watching i love you all so much subscribe down below and yeah i'll see you all very soon bye